Hello, everybody. Welcome to Let's Try. My name is Retromation. This is Kaiju Wars, a turn-based strategy game where you play as the hopelessly outclassed army fighting kaijus. <laughs> Let's go on in. You can't stop me, Godzilla. Let's go. In to check... Oh, okay, okay. So we got... Directed by... Okay. We got like a little bit of a, uh, a comic book that doubles as... What seems like our level select? Oh my god. FMV. We got FMV elements? Alright, let's go on. Xenophon. Progress report. Master, preparations are complete. Four units are combat ready, along with the necessary support personnel. Several strategic plans are ready for overview. Only four? Simulation show four units to be sufficient with an 87% success rate. 70% of enemy formations wield outdated weaponry and inca incapable of significantly damaging any of our units. Expected campaign length? Five acts. Estimated 45 missions. <laughs> In calendar time, please. Four weeks before total capitulation. And first target? The megacity of Flodio, population 1.2 billion, technologically advanced, though lacking in military. Any high priority targets? One, Dr. Emma Wagner, and a new mayor. Sending profile summary now. Wagner and this mayor? Yes, I see why. Xenophon, I formally approve strategic plan 9. Launch your attack, but remember your purpose. Yes, master. 87% success rate, huh? Okay. The Flodio! The year's 20XX sprawling megacities cover much of the Earth, replacing nation-states as centers of political power. The city of Flodio is famed throughout the world for its cutting-edge technology, shimmering skyscrapers, and extremely long office hours. Powerful waves crash against the island, si island city's majestic coast and picturesque Mount Fumi as a popular site for tours. You have just been elected mayor of this magnificent metropolis. You're already looking forward to a peaceful term of extended city council meetings and detailed discussions of zoning bylaws. After all, that's what you're playing this game for, isn't it? Yes. City builder, in we go. Oh, here it is. Dead Meat Gulch. Is this them? <laughs> is this me, the mayor? Out in the boonies where nothing ever happens. Is that me, the mayor? Welcome to the- okay. Welcome to the Dead Meat Gulch Army Base. Uh, your highness? Your honor? Uh, where I put my notes? Ah, got it. Your worship! That's what I'm supposed to call the mayor? Yes. Well, you can call me Major. Yeah, spelled almost the same as mayor, I guess, but don't worry. I won't try and take your job. I get very sleepy even thinking about property taxes or public transport planning. I'm just here to guide your inspection of this here army base, seeing as it's on the Flodio outskirts. <laughs> okay. You can barely call it a base. Most of the vehicles here belong in a museum. Ha! Huh? But don't worry, everything's well maintained and totally up to code. Commander Carl runs a tight ship here. Why isn't he running the inspection? Well, you see, he's, uh, we had this call, and so he had to... Okay, shoot, I admit it, I lost the coin toss, but hey, now at least he owes me lunch. All right, let's get started. What's that warning siren? It's been so long since one of those has gone off around here that I don't think I really know what it means. Blast, where's Commander Carl when you need him? Let's get to the command room and see what's up. I love the wipe. Oh my god. Incoming kaiju! Look at these visuals. Who mama? Wonder what tripped our siren. Probably just an armadillo or some kind of... Some kid playing with a drone. Well, let's shoot it down. Wee! Left click on the highlighted bases to deploy your double A gun. Your AA gun and fighter. Just either one. Free. This is not a drill. Oh my god. It's not Zilla. That's awesome. Maybe it's friendly. It's as big as a building. The biggest and scaliest gosh darned armadillo I've ever seen. Let's blast it to pieces. Units can move, then attack. Left click on the AA gun, right click on the highlighted tile. My god. Fighters move four spaces and can fly over any terrain. Move your fighter now. Deploy missiles at your army base. 
Okay. Click the end turn button. Way ahead of you. Not really, but hey. Oh, hell. Well, that ain't great. Did that thing just crush Carl? Carl! Looks like the big fella's eyeing up our army base. You can click on him to view his possible paths. Click on him now. Them bean counters have mathed out the probabilities. It'll step on each space or something. I don't really get it myself. Okay, so there's a 100% chance it'll attack. And then a 50% chance it'll move to one of these. Is that what it is? But we can also view his stats. Colored box is a hit point, And then left, we can see his current movement speed. Okay. If we damage it enough, it'll slow down, so go get him. All right, missiles. Missiles are awkward. It costs them two movement points to enter rough terrain like the Forest Hills or Rubble. Okay. Move your missiles next to the monster to attack. I mean... Sounds good. Uh, it's still coming, I know. Tanks will stop. Deploy tanks, then end your turn. Okay. Don't want to do anything with the fighter? I mean, you know, whatever. Oh, no. Wait, we downed him? No. Tanks are tough. Looks like it actually slowed him. It costs Kaiju one movement point just to destroy a tank without moving on to its space. Since that was the monster's last movement point, our base is safe for now. Okay. Never surrender all remaining units. Oh, keeps shooting. Okay. Clear rubble for free. I mean, sure. Launch him up. We got nothing. We can't make anything else. Rest in peace, my friend. Can you destroy this and then take his spot? Oh my god, the sound. Our military is incompetent. Two suburbs are equally close to him. Those are filled with people. What can we do? I don't know. What can we do? Seems like the only thing I can do is... Knock him down. I have a sneaking suspicion when we get to the other part of the game, we'll be able to clear the rubble for free. Uh, R.I.P. Carl. I don't know. Maybe we're supposed to lose this, even. For all I'm aware. It retreats for now. Oh, I'm going to bed. Will it return? Gotta sign up for the army. Huh, where'd it go? How can something so big disappear? Oh, we totally drove that scary fella off. Yeehaw! Good thing we didn't panic. Or anything, hee <laughs> hee. Or I hope we can still get out of this basement of the army base after that armadillo crushed the roof. I'm so excited to get there. Kaiju Wars begun. You thought it would be extremely easy being Flodio's mayor. Ah, it's floaty, floaty. It's to It's a very weird adjacent to Tokyo. Then the kaiju came. Uh, construct a base as quickly as possible so you can rally your forces and try back that monster. Well, we lost the tank hangar, but at least the command bunker's still okay. Ring. Hello? Did any of my... Why is it still ringing? Did any of my seismometers go off? Uh, who is this? My seismometers. Blinking lights on the console, ones that you don't know what they mean. Are there any... Doesn't really narrow it down. I don't think even Carl knew what most of these mean. But yeah, there's a bunch of blinking doohickeys. How exciting. There should be a great data box beneath the lights under the dash. Please bring it to my lab. Who are you? You need to hurry. There are more kaiju coming this way. Uh, well, so that was weird. Either way, Mayor, we better get you, both you and this box back to civilization. My god. Alright. 
Another one of my seismometers has been tripped. That means there's a Kaiju coming this way. Please protect my lab and buy us time while I work. I don't like taking orders from randos, but regardless, it's our duty to protect civilians. However, the region doesn't have an army base or an airfield. We won't be able to deploy any units until we construct a base. Mayor, save up some of that sweet tax money and build a base as soon as possible. Okay. <laughs> Picking up seismic activity in this area. How do I... How do I build? You lose if Wagner dies. I mean, is it just like I'm supposed to... Am I supposed to wait to generate money? Ah, there we go. We can build on a foundation. It didn't point that out. Okay. Um, let's have the airfield back here. Ah, okay. So we don't have enough money. I, that was correct. Ah! It's, it's King Kong-ish. God, it looks super cool. There we go. Okay, so we get money based off of all of those. Some buildings produce money each turn. Money can be used for deploying or repairing units and constructing buildings. Wait. What's that blue beaker? I've never seen it before. That'd be science. Fill up the science meter and we're one step closer to victory. So science equals victory, huh? I can dig it. Let that's, let's keep that science rolling. Should I have enough money now? Click on the colored foundation to construct an army base or an airfield. Let's start with the army base up front. What If we could have done it preemptively. So it looks like I can't build on the same turn that I, or I can't spawn anything on the same turn that I built that. That thing is screwed, man. This is giving me into the breach vibes if it wasn't actually anything really the same. Because <laughs> I, here's the thing. I know for a fact that everybody's going to comment into the breach, but it's like that mixed with a city builder, so it's really not that close. Uh, all right, that, I mean, it's close though. It, 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 in like the hex grid based thing, strategic turn based protecting buildings kind of thing, that that's the the area where it's close, but it's really not. It's really not that similar, truly. Uh, the ape just tore down Flodia Tower. I'm telling you, Mayor, this means war. We couldn't build on. Okay, so all of these cost three bucks. Unit ready. Can't move, though, and I can't summon anything else there. And we don't have enough money to summon any other buildings. Who gave you my personal number? Did that ridiculous muscle man actually figure out how to use the call display? Anyways, I'm quite busy now. Just keep that ape away from me and let me do my work in peace. Oh, hell. The visual style is so neat. It's like, um... It really, really reminds me of, like, really early PC... PC games. But... But made now. Like, obviously. Like, much cleaner. It's, it's so... Oh, it's so nice. Seeing it, like, in this more modern sense. Uh, click to select a unit, right-click on a highlighted square to move, move adjacent to the monster to attack. Remember to display, deploy more units after attacking. Alright, get him up there. I want another tank. Like, I, right now I want to go for, like, a little bit of a stall tactic. I think that's the way to go. Plus seven next turn, okay. Oh, no! The three movement tiles. Economy! So we're up to 14. Click on the advisor portion at the bottom left. Speak with your mission advisors. Ah, I need some advice. You called the right guy. I've served in two wars and have dozens of medals of distinction. What's that? Why aren't I, I a general yet? Well, that's a long story. Don't you have a monster to fight or something? Oh, all right. Advice. Build an army base, make tanks, place tanks in the path of the monster. You got all that because I got metal designing shiny. Okay, I mean, that that was that was my plan. 
I also, like, okay, I thought that we could make more tanks. That's the reason to... That's the reason to do it like that. Gotcha. I like that you really do feel like you are playing the inept army against the kaiju. You're like, why am I even summoning these if they're just going to get smushed in one turn? But it's like they have actual... They do something. Slowly. So we slow him down. That helps a little. If it bleeds, we can kill it. Downing a monster earns a breakthrough, and we need two breakthroughs to win. All right. So now I'd say let's deploy... Wait, repair tank? Oh, we can summon a new tank. Ah, yeah, they weren't dead. Sure. So we get the free attack off here, and then if he wants to attack back, it's going to cause him to use his turn. That's... I couldn't place it in the way of that right now, but that's okay. Oh! There's something about the font that just isn't quite uh, fitting it. Like, it kind of works when it's right there. But when the, with the pop-up, it's there's something... I don't know if it's with, like, the resolution or something. It just doesn't look as high quality as the rest of the game. And I guess, like, the vector images... It being on the vector images feels out of place, too. But, like, that's... Uh, of things to complain about, that's, like, nothing. <laughs> that's, like... It's, like, jack squat nothing. Oh, right, there we go. We can take up this slot. I don't know how much it's really gonna help. But we'll move you up here. Move you up here. So why can't we... We can't deploy anything else because there's no more things we could deploy. All right, not bad, not bad. So if we do this, do we down him before he actually, oh my God. And then he does get a free attack on the building. Yes, I'd like to buy some house insurance. Oh my God, the humor in this is, is hitting. All right, tank, go there. Uh, You know what? We can just corner him. That's going to be good enough. Actually, I'm going to undo that move. It's a free attack. We're in the way. We get one free damage there. Might as well go for it. We don't. We can't build anything else. What's he going for? Please go for the tank. Oh, he's going for the tank. Nice. That is ideal. Also, there is an audio clipping issue. Like, the issues that I'm having are, like, very... Very tiny things that will probably be fixed. This is to make it clear. This is this is a demo. Ooh, look! Look at that little zoom. Of, oh. Ooh, wait a minute. Block him off. Repair the tank for a dollar. If we could have uh, like flanked pincered or something, like move you up here. That's going to be the better situation. We won't really want to block him off by all angles, but I think he dies no matter who he attacks right now. Wait, can he attack both of those? In the same hit? I mean, it doesn't matter. He's dead. Yeah, that's that's the audio clipping issue. It's like minor things. I'm really I'm really into this, though. It's retreating. That's right. Run. We did it. Drinks are on me tonight. It's oozing style. Oozing. Like, I'm curious, obviously, um, what will make or break this is how strategic does it get moving forward that's really what will make or break this game when it comes out we're in a breakthrough if we can get one more breakthrough we should be able to push the monsters back -na -na -na. science breakthrough nice ah uh, no more monster battles live to die another day i'm going to bed what happened why is it leaving it's leaving because i managed to complete my anti-kaiju serum I gave it to my one of my grad students who administered it to the monster just now. Oh, is that the kid who ran by carrying the huge banana? The what? The giant banana. He said it was important. We hung it from the balcony of the last ruined building. Well, I suppose at least it worked. Please come back to my lab straight away. We have much to discuss. Ba -ba -ba -ba. 
We did it. We cut it close there. The Kaiju Wars begin completed. Medals are collected throughout your campaign. What do they do? Well, they're shiny. You know, that's reason enough for me. Just minutes ago, the famous Flotio Tower office complex collapsed underneath the 300-foot <laughs> gorilla that was climbing it. In the waterfront district, a giant lizard-shaped monster was spotted chasing after a food truck. Please stay calm and remain indoors unless your building is falling down around you. <laughs> All right. You know... Why the hell not? In a remote region in the Flodio Coast, uh, Kaiju has been sighted dangerously close to the Mysterious Doctor's lab. Hold out as long as you can and be sure to ev evacuate when the monster gets too close. Sure. Sure. I wonder if- yeah, like... Oh my god. This lab is the address we have been given. Hello, my name is Dr. Emma Wagner. Welcome to my lab. Sensor data now, if you please. Not exactly a people person. I thought doctors were trained in bedside manner, eh, Mayor? By the blank expressions on your face, I assume you have questions. I have dated a process, so please keep them short. Doctor, what, what ailments do you treat, Doc? Unfortunately, I'm not a medical doctor, so I can't treat your stupidity. Specifically, I study kaiju. I have published 12 papers on this subject, appearing in the famous journals such as Journal or, journal or World Prehistory, Kaijun, and Tokatsu Ace. Famous, huh? Can't say I've heard of them, but then again, I may be incurably stupid. Ha ha. How fascinating. Yes, the kai- uh, the kaiju. The data confirms what I've suspected. Care to fill us in, Doc? The data is recorded from seismometer. A seismometer measures ground noises and shaking, normally used for recording earthquakes, volcanic eruptions, or explosions. For a few years now, I've been recording an odd small-scale earthquakes in the dead meat- dead meat gulch area. This was odd, as we're nowhere near a fault line, meaning earthquakes should not occur here. I now believe those odd, small-scale quakes were kaiju moving about. We should work to be able to track their general area and direction using highly sensitive seismometers. You can track them? Yeehaw! Time for a good old-fashioned deer hunt. Hunt them? No, no. They're the hunters, and we're the prey. Speaking of which, we better start evacuating. One of them is coming this way. Mage of the military has excess vehicles, correct? We do. However, we're short-staffed at the moment. Only my base has had time to mobilize and deploy. It's fine. My grad students will evacuate the equipment from the lab as the kaiju approaches. They simply appear to be targeting the nearest building. What makes you think they're coming for you specifically? Have my suspicions. Just be ready to get us out of here, Major. Yes, ma'am. You're the Dr. Mayor. Let's get prepared. What if she was the Kaiju? This is my lab. Protect it. Gotcha. Hey, this region's a lot better developed than the last one. That's a great. That's great. We can start rolling out our troops right away. That's a great. Fighter, bomber. Oh, that's right. Okay, so that's right. We could have made this other base, but it, we didn't need it. We didn't need it. There's no undeveloped plots. Okay, so it's coming up there. Let's start with the tank then. Ah! It's not Zilla! He's a giant armadillo monster. No match for our tanks. Yes, yes, of course. I can't do anything here. In relation to, uh... Jumping up there. I can't go in the water. I could make a fighter pilot. These are almost certainly screwed. We'll start with that. I mean, he's gonna leave. He's gotta leave the water sometime. Right? He's gotta. Save us! What? Black Ops 1, cancel one security. What? It appears the Kaiju are not our only concern. Suspicious events are affecting our city. 
and detect a pattern on them. This pattern is likely to evolve the dark project taking place every turn. I believe a sinister force may be behind all of this. Aw, oh, beans. Be must be prepared for anything. Missiles, and let's get a fighter. Roger that. Okay, we're at least standing in the way of him making it over here. When evacuated my lab, you can chain escape vehicles. Move my truck onto or next to our harbor, and I can switch to a boat that moves immediately. There's no limit to this chaining. With proper planning, we can make a considerable distance. As long as I get to a different lab safely, I can continue my work. Oh. You move your truck transport immediately. You can transfer to a faster moving boat by moving next to a harbor or plane by moving next to an airfield. Switch to boat. Gotcha. When evacuating my lab, you can change escape vehicles, move my truck onto or next to a harbor. Yeah. I, yeah. Where, where's the other lab? Oh, I can go to any other lab? If the civilians get wind that Dr. Wagner's on the run, they're likely to panic. That means you won't make any money or science, so keep the doc hard at work in a lab. Of course, trained soldiers like me are never panic, ever, nope, not at all. Okay. Well, that's good. I tried. Oh, no. Panic group grips the city as Dr. Wagner is not in a lab working on her anti-monster serum. No science or money. Okay. Gotcha. Someone's trying to find the doc. See those red locks in the lower left? That's her security. If it gets fully canceled, Dr. Wagner's location goes public. My gut tells me when that happens, the monitor will head straight for her. Oh, no. I mean, we'll just transfer the lab. That was the plan. We don't have any money this turn. Next turn, we should be fine, though. That's an interesting uh, strategic development. Did we need to move to a different lab? Or was that just something we did for the kicks and wiggles? Do you have no, you have no issues moving through the forest? Doesn't even inhibit movement in any capacity. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, so... Oh, boy. Science breakthrough. That's good. Wait, buildings like lookouts or army bases or source of security. Each one that gets knocked down makes Dr. Wagner easier for spies and enemies to find. You know... Screw you guys. I guess we'll just do something like this. That's a knockdown. That's a lower speed, and then we can get ourselves cleaned up like that. And we'll get you over here so we can hopefully go for like a flank. We got a bomber in the, on the uh, on the deploy as well. What's it gonna be, my boy? Oh no. Oh, no. That's a lot of free movement, man. My tax money! Okay. So, the good news is we can flank, almost certainly. This bomber might even... Breaches occur. The invader has overcome our security. Red alert, we've got a breach. The Kaiser's headed straight for Dr. Wagner's last lo known location. There's no need to panic. We have an emergency measures in place. If the Kaiser gets too close, we can evacuate. Okay. So we just evacuated early. Gotcha. Heck. Music is, like, really bumping. I don't love the spot for our tank here, but hey. 
it works. I don't think we need to evacuate yet. We know that they're heading out that way, and we actually have pretty good defenses in that direction. Oh! Tail swipe, destroy an adjacent enemy. Oh, no. So that was just a free action, huh? That's one of the things above the head. So that's something we can look into a little bit more. Oh, this is gnarly. This is gnarly. When our bases get destroyed, we're in for a rough time. The good news is... The fact that they're heading to the Doomsday Clock. Monsters recover 8 health. Reshuffle Dark Projects. Oh, Jesus. The good news is... Question mark, question mark, question mark. Put it in terms you might understand. You can think of them like a deck of cards. I, I missed that. It pops up there. Once they run out, they'll be reshuffled and repeat themselves. However, well, Security Breach is in effect. Dark Projects that cancel Security, like Black Ops, will be skipped. We should therefore expect the most dangerous dark projects to occur with the greater frequency during a breach. Understood. So do we, do we move? Should we move you now or next turn? Doctor Wagner becomes hidden when she boards the transport that the lab shoots in is still being targeted by the monster. I mean, my plan is to get her over to this lab, I guess. It's not much better, but it is safer than going back to this lab. So apparently we should have stayed, but like they were talking about it, so I thought that maybe that meant that we should, but you know, whatever. I was wrong. Minus one speed. Okay. Is that the that was not the bomber. This is the first time seeing the bomber. I don't even know what the bomber does. I don't know. Not much. Okay. We're good. We're not going to make money next turn. <laughs> I just I just now saw the the plane get sent. So that's the plan. We're gonna. This is not even gonna get in the way. It's, it's not a tank. I mean, we're not in there anymore. Oh, jeez. Recover eight health. Is there any? Is there any chance for us to win? Panic grips the city's doctor. Wagner's not in the lab. We're gonna see him. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, God. Can't really get in the way too much right now. As much as I want to get in the way. So let's just go in a spot where we can do some kind of damage. If we do this, if we do enough damage, we can lower the speed, which uh, the fact that it only does one is not great. I feel like this unit kind of is trash. Wait, oh, but it does two on a counter. I see. That's an important stat. I don't need to evacuate yet. She's not in a good spot. Let me b make that clear. Man, that free attack is gnarly. If we could just, like, not get the Doomsday Clock so freaking much, that would be, like, the most ideal. Will rent go up? Asking the real questions. Science breakthrough. Thank God. If we could knock down the monster, we get one more breakthrough. But... At this point, I'm really just thinking science is the answer. I can't get in the way at this point. Summoning the tank up here is a big issue. 
You don't even move faster on, um, on roads. Okay, it's definitely going for that. We could, like, if we sent ourselves out and then went up here, we would be losing out on a lot of money that I think we kind of need. Oh, that sucks. We should think about that a little bit more. Because it's only in the front of the rear. Wait, side of the rear? It, it comes out so quickly. Thank God we, we got the... That one I prefer right now than the heal, because we might be able to get the KO. We might. An adjacent unit at the rear. Okay, so that's just a free action forever, always and forever. So... Do we know... Did he just... Didn't he just rotate? Is this... Oh, okay. Wait, everything is your rear. You got a lot of rear, my boy. Okay, but we just need to get absolutely in the way. You know what? It's fine. Let's just go do some damage. Let's do something. We might be able to knock out. It's it's going to be a free kill here, though, but we're not even going to get the counterattack, but I think it's okay. We'll be able to build something else, you know? Bye-bye. We just... We really need to get in front of him, but we... I don't know how many turns we should spend letting him destroy buildings in order to set ourselves up properly. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is kind of nice. We know that he's going to go for that, and then he's going to come back. So, the idea to set up here is a little bit more logical. I don't know if we're going to do it. Yeah, we're going to do it. Okay. Good stuff. Also, we're going to win via science anyways at this point. Since he's going up that way, that's really ideal. The amount of time it'll take for him to get back. I mean, it's not that, it's not that much. He just destroys everything without even any concern. All right. Yeah, we're fine. Yep, there's the breach. Into the... But we're, we're absolutely fine. Absolutely fine. Don't evacuate. We need... We don't need the money. I'm going to do it anyways. Bring it on, punk. Come at me. Try and just, you try and kill me. Ouch. Man, that is disgusting. They're, they're pulling that card so often. I'm confused. Is it, like, scripted to... Oh, what? Is it scripted to be terrible? There we go. We want the tank in the front. That's really the big thing. We should evacuate. I'm I'm happy with my greed though. I'm very happy with my greed. Yeah, they can't they cannot make it there. We're golden. Science victory! Which probably happens right after this anyways. Beep, beep, beep. Considering we evacuated early for no reason, uh, I'm really happy that we... Um, we seemingly made it out of here okay. Is it, it was close. 
It was very close. Recover eight health. I feel like this one, this level is like on purpose. So like, it's supposed to be this. Ah, wait, so I shouldn't have left the building. So you only get science when I'm in the building. All right. We only get it when I'm in the building. Only then. I don't know why we're even like, I guess it, it it's worth taking them down a bit because of the, um, the movement speed penalty. How do I get you back over though? <laughs> Cause don't I need a, don't I need a dock? Don't I need the duck? Let's send you to the... Oh, God. Um, we need to send you to an airfield. So yeah, really, really the thing is we just shouldn't have taken you out of the lab because I, I was f afraid because it was like a 25% chance to lose, just like straight up lose right then. And I forgot that we need the harbor to get back in the water. So it's like, you can, oh, it's like a one way. And I can't undo my turn enough to remove this fighter, which sucks. You're slow on these, I'm pretty sure. All right. We might be fine. We might be fine, and if we're not, that's okay. I mean, it's good we weren't in there this turn. That much is for sure. And he's not gonna chase me down. So... This is tight. This is tight. We actually... We could be bopped. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is a no-brainer. And this, we really just need to make it so you can't get to get up here. Okay, I, my concern was that I did not know if we could move on the same turn that we switched to a plane. That was really the big concern there. We're fine. It's going to take a little bit because we can't science until uh, the son of a gun gets back to the building. We really should have never left. But again, it was like I, I, I saw the dialogue. And it was like, you can get out of the you can get out of your lab by evacuating. Like, okay? Usually when a tutorial tells you that, it's like, do it right now. But we didn't need to. It's fine. It's fine. We're cutting it close. Throwing for content, I think they call it. Okay. Doesn't even matter if you're there or not. You just you barely cause any problems. We just need it. End turn. We're not gonna get any kind of bonuses. No sir. No sir. No sir. No sir. Whoop. Could have been bad. It's crush. There we go. We've done it, kind of. Yes, yes, I'm well aware there's panic.
Oh, so it reveals where they are. Okay, it reveal reveals where they are when they're in the building, too. What? You can't make it there, right? I really wish you were facing this way, because you're just going to flick that guy away for free. I'm just really hoping this works. And that the red doesn't mean that he actually can traverse that far for free. Oh my god, wait. That's probably what the tail means, isn't it? That he has free movement in water? Maybe the slowdown will actually save us. It totally did. It totally did. If, he has, if that meant that he has free movement in water... Finally. God. That that could have been over so quickly if we didn't um, misread the tutorial. Or not, we didn't misread it. Just, I tried to metagame it, I guess, by saying, why are you telling me this? Well, that wasn't so bad. Easy for you to say when your workplace wasn't smashed to pieces. I assure you, there were no real danger. You were in no real danger whatsoever. I don't think my getaway van driver would agree. Yeah, we definitely did not complete by turn 12 because of the uh, the early evacuate and then the second evacuate. We could have just won that turn, but it was a 25% chance that we would lose, you know, because if, if Wagner dies, we lose. So obviously it wasn't worth taking the risk. But alas, that is that, and that is going to do it for today. My name is Retromation. This has been Kaiju Wars. You can check out the demo right now. I believe it is still live. Yep, it is still live on Steam. Full release is coming out, or... Uh, I believe it's full release. Coming out in February of 2022. So wishlist it and check it on out. See how it develops as it moves forward. But that's going to do it. Thank you for watching. My name is Roger Mation. I cover indie games every single day. If you're into that kind of a thing, you're going to want to make sure you subscribe. Because you don't want to miss out on any great independent game gems like this. And uh, hey, it's free. And you can always just undo it later if you're like, oh shoot, I made a huge mistake. But that's that. Thank you, thank you. And I'll see you next time. Bye.